What is good, John? Welcome back to yet again another episode of J.I. Productions. It's your boy J.I. and I'm back at it again with another banker video. Now, as you guys can tell by the title and the thumbnail of this video, man, we are going to be installing some more carbon fiber on the car. And I can't lie, I did a little bit of a test fit, a little bit of a mock-up. I cheated, I'm going to be honest. But trust me, when I tell y'all, these, these joints look crazy, bro. They... They definitely look crazy. The car for sure is now missing the front splitter only, but it definitely helps the front end. So that being said, I'm going to go ahead and roll that intro and we're going to get straight into this banger. So let's go ahead and get it. All right, y'all, so as y'all can see, we are on the GoPro, you feel me, head mount, so I could be a little hands-free, more hands-on with this install. But first and foremost, straight out the box, bro, you're not going to get any adhesive at all. No double-sided sticky tape, nothing. That's laid on the material. However, they do provide you with a roll of double-sided sticky tape. These joints is the thin joints, so you might want to be a little excessive when you lay them. I've got a total of five strips laid. I was debating on putting a strip right here, but I don't know if I'm gonna do it just because of fitment. So with that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and lay it over just so we can see what it's gonna look like. And I think I'm gonna add, I think I am gonna add that layer right here just for extra security, but I think I think it's gonna be good just like that, man. So that being said, I'm gonna go ahead and add that strip right here and right here, and then we'll peel everything off, clean the surface, and actually lay this joint. But y'all get a little sneak peek of what that joint's finna look like, man. Ooh, with the, with the hood, with the uh. I know my side skirts got a little eczema. They need some goddamn cocoa butter. Don't get on me in the comments. It's cool, you feel me? But it's still carbon fiber. Then we got the handle. Then we got the goddamn antenna, the goddamn dolphin snout, you feel me? Then we got the goddamn, you know, the chef's table with the goddamn carbon trunk. So yeah, it's, it's all coming together, no cap. Uh, but let me go ahead and get these little strips added to this area right here and right here. And we should be good to lay this joint. But that looks so clean. Also, disclaimer, bro. This only covers literally the outside half of your mirror. So if your car is not black or you don't have a 1LE like I do, your mirror is going to show whatever the true color of your car is right on this little layer right here. But don't worry, like as far as for my people that got OCD, you know what I'm saying? The line is very precise and it is very sharp. So it shouldn't like mess with you too much or nothing like that. You're going to be straight. As you guys can see, it looks pretty damn good. This is going to be a two part video and um, we will try to find a gas station with some good lighting, but I'm not hundred percent sure if I'm going to use that as being like the full, like unveiling for real you know you gotta see carbon in the sun like to really get like you know i'm gonna give y'all a little flash love yeah you know what i'm saying like you really gotta like get that carbon in the light to get it to really you know what i'm saying get it to really dance like that but we're finna go ahead and fully lay this joint man i'm stoked as i said in the intro man your boy is hurt my splitter is on back order. I can't even get one yet. I finally made up my mind. If you guys follow me on TikTok, y'all know I've been on the fence about which one to get. If I should just, you know, be like everybody else and get the one that everybody else gets, or if I should, you know, take the road that I normally take, that nobody take, and, and be different. Um, and I decided to just, you know, do just that. Take the road nobody take and be different. And of course, it bit me back in the butt because it's out of stock. But yeah, I think that's, yeah, I think that's gonna be fire right there. Yeah, we can do that. So now I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna clean the surface first. They do provide you with a little alcohol wipes, you know what I'm saying? You get in there. I mean, if you laid carbon before, you already know what it is, man. Again, shout out to the homies over at Next Gen Speed, you know what I'm saying? Best, one of the best sponsors the kid got. I ordered these 
carbon mirror covers i want to say like three days ago bro like two and a half days so that goes to tell you what they shipping looking like if they got this stuff in stock you're gonna get it rather quickly bro you're not gonna be waiting for real but you just want to make sure that you get every inch that the carbon is going to be touching bro to make sure that you got a clean surface for the double size sticky tape to adhere to bro because if you don't you're gonna be doing like 130 140 in mexico you know what i'm saying and reaching for your hazards and the next thing you know your carbon cover gonna be flying you be playing mario kart trying to take the person you racing out you know what i'm saying throwing a god damn it j.i fucking up but you're gonna be throwing a banana at you you know what i'm saying it ain't gonna be cool bro they're gonna be like oh nah you cheated i ain't paying you fan me no pay and then y'all gonna have to you know what i'm saying do what y'all do i can't really say that right now because you know youtube gonna demonetize this video but you know y'all know y'all been to mexico y'all know how it go when people don't want to pay you feel me so for this part bro i ain't even gonna lie i'm probably not finna record this because this is the most tedious part of working with double size sticky tape it's taking the red part off especially when this the double size sticky tape you're working with is hella tiny bro as y'all can see i ain't even got a starter part yet so i'm gonna cut to when all of this is taken off all right y'all so as y'all can see we got all the all the covers off of the double size sticky tape man we are ready to apply it to the car so let's just go ahead make sure we got it straight and oh yeah y'all yeah, that's some that's it joint already didn't get caught you feel me just gonna hold it for like 30 seconds make sure you got it up against the mirror exactly where you want it because after this it should not come off and if it does, then, you know, you're going to have to get a new one. Nine times out of ten, this comes off, you ain't getting it back. And if you do, it's going to be cracked. And that's a fact. Damn, you heard them bars, boy? Let me, let me chill out, bro. Let me chill out, bro. Family. Boy, Gully about to get a feature out of me for the free ski. <laughs> boy about to get a feature out of me for the free ski. <laughs> Yo, that looks so good, bro. Oh my god. Like Yeah, I'm rocking with that. I ain't going to cap. I'm rocking with that. So as y'all can see, we got the carbon hood, flow, flow, carbon mirror, flow, flow, handles, antenna, trunk. That's so clean. <laughs> so now Shout out to my boy Gully. He went ahead and added some strips for me on this one already. So all we have to do is go to the passenger side, clean that joint up with this alcohol wipe that I just dropped on the floor. <clears throat> clean it up with this alcohol wipe and then do the same thing, lay this on, and then we're gonna hit the car wash. So as you can see, I just put a whole bunch of fingerprints on Vader. So we're gonna get this thing washed up. And like I said, try to see if we can find a gas station with some good lighting and get some good 4k footage with the vlogging camera for you guys some good detail shots maybe even do a montage i haven't done one in a minute so y'all just you know what i'm saying if you haven't already hit that like button for the kid right now you know what i'm saying show your boys some love we got that carbon and i just do the discount code on the screen for y'all one more time saving y'all some money it's free to leave a like it's free to subscribe it's free to repost i mean how could you say no you dig but that being said we finna go ahead oh yeah that boy too clutch that boy came to my house and gave me a cold water that's crazy that's crazy i was gonna offer you one before we hit the road anyway shout out to my boy man you feel me i can't show him too much just because of the if you know you know but shout out to my boy make sure you go follow him his ig pops up right here fifth gen is stupid pressure and if you want to line up next to that motherfucker he ain't ducking no smoke but with that being said we about to go ahead and repeat this exact process on the passenger side and then we're gonna cut to once we get to the car wash or after the car wash one of the two let's get it did y'all really think I wasn't gonna give y'all a startup? Come on now. Sheesh. Now, how 
could I deprive y'all of something so great as this? Oh my God. Sheesh. All right, let's hit the road, man. touchless wash do its thing man i ain't gonna lie the last time i came here was the track day and the dryers did an amazing job to the point where i really didn't even need a towel so hopefully fingers crossed the dryers are working just as good tonight and i really don't need a towel because i don't have one <laughs> um but either way it goes you guys know we did ceramic coat and paint correct this car when we first picked it up so i'm not too worried one thing that I am worried about though is the fact that we just put these covers on and now they're getting hit with water and they did not have no time to drive for real, for real. So we're going to see how this goes. I guess you could say this is the ultimate test right here. Um, so yeah, I don't know though. I, I really don't know. I'm low key scared. I really hope that they don't come off during the drive over here. I didn't see them like rattling or shaking or anything like that, but now we're adding soap and water to them joints, so hopefully they don't lift. I hope they don't lift. I really do. Um, I, re I really, really do. I can't lie. But yeah, man, we're going to go ahead and let the wash do its thing, and then I'll get back with you guys once we're done. All right, y'all. So we are done. It says we're good to go. I can't lie. Just judging by how hard the dryers were blowing, I think that the car is going to be pretty dry for the most part. Um, but like I said, we're going to go hit a spot with some good lighting. This gas station might be halfway decent, though. So we'll see. I think this gas station might work, though. It might. It might. Let me get out the car, and I'll double check. If I like it, then we'll switch to this boy right here. But if I don't like it, then we're going to a different location. Either way it goes, the next clip you guys will see will be in 4K. So let's get it. And there you guys have it, man. So as y'all can see, we got the carbon fiber mirror caps on that joint. Throws perfectly with the hood. Oh my God, this angle right here. There's so much carbon in the frame right now, boy. Oh my God. So I'm finna go ahead and shoot a quick B-roll because I'm not trying to get kicked out. But y'all already know, gotta get the B-roll footage for y'all. So let's go ahead and keep that. you guys so without further ado that's gonna wrap it up for today's video as you guys can see we got the carbon fiber mirror caps on there man vader is looking so good y'all already know what the deal is man if you've been here before let me know in the comment section down below what you guys think of the carbon fiber be sure to use the promo code that pops up on the screen when you're shopping with next gen speed for your carbon fiber needs you dig but with that being said if you're new to the channel hit that subscribe button turn on post notifications get this video a big thumbs up if you're rocking with the carbon and i'm gonna go ahead and roll that outro i'll see y'all in the next one peace